For those of you who haven't checked out the latest from Halo Waypoint, another story dropped recently, this time about the trials of Atriox. The short story is from the perspective of Gunnery Sergeant Elena Bobruff, a survivor of the raid on the Infinity and the Battle of the Reverie. During the hellish two-day battle, she was knocked unconscious and taken prisoner by the Banished. Then she was carted off to the House of Reckoning, the same stage we fight in as the Master Chief in the campaign. Gunner Sergeant Bob Ruff has an interesting story, so I wanted to do a quick video on it. She was born in 2522 on the planet Alluvian. During her time in the UNSC, she's had plenty of involvement with the Spartan branch. In 2552, she assisted Gauntlet team in civilian evacuation operations. After evacuating from Reach herself, she continued to fight the Covenant, then was stationed aboard the UNSC Infinity after the war. In 2557, she took part in the first Battle of Requiem, including fighting alongside the Chief himself. We actually see her in Halo 4 as one of the M510 Mammoth Drivers. She went on to serve aboard the Infinity during the second Battle of Requiem as well. Even more impressive was that she also landed back on Reach in 2559 during Operation Wolf, which saw Blue Team in need of support to push back the Banished before Cortana arrived. She was still with the Infinity when she abandoned ship on December 12th, 2559 and made her way back to the Mortal Reverie. On January 31st, 2560, her squad was attacked by a group of brute berserkers. Gunnery Sergeant Bob Ruff, along with a Spartan from Fireteam Lancer, another Marine, a Corporal, and an Elite, presumably a defector, all members of the group unfortunately perished valiantly after fighting off an unknown number of banished forces. What a badass story. Had to share this one. Happy New Year's, everybody.